Hey guys, what's up? It's the Trigger Live again, and I'm just uh, bringing you another Halo Reach video. Um, I'm, what am I playing on here? Shit, I already forgot the name. Uh, Boneyard, that's it. Um, yeah, playing some Invasion. And last game, as you guys remember, just got a text. Last game, as you guys remember, I was uh, mostly just killing. So this game, well, I'm killing right now, but this game, I play lots of object, lots of objective. And, um, it's not an extremely high score, but objective's pretty crazy. Now, I was looking through my Bungie Net, um, uh, stats, and I found a game where I was 62 and 6. And I don't even remember which game it was, and it was two videos behind from, all, like, the videos that save. So I can't record it. It's really pissing me off. I have a game where I'm 43 and 2, I think, but it's all with a Scorpion tank. Well, pretty much, like, 90% of the kills are with a Scorpion tank, so... If you guys want to see that, just comment, but it's, I think it's 43 and 2, or 43 and 3. Um, and it's me and another guy versus four other people, because two of our teammates quit. And I forget if we win or lose, but it's still a pretty pretty beast game for both of us, where we do it pretty tactically. And, um, yeah, so here I'm just playing on Boneyard. As you can see, I've already, I don't know if I already got a kill streak, I'm not even watching the video. I'm just using uh, the Boneyard. If you spawn here, it's if you spawn as humans first, you can get a really good kill streak built up, like I do. Unfortunately, I didn't betray this guy. Luckily, uh, the other guy injured him, so it doesn't count as betrayal for me. But um, yeah, at the end of this video, um, I go to Bungie.net and I take my stats for the game, and I will put post it up at the end of this video. Tell me if you like that or whatever. And um, also. Those uh, last two clips that I put up, I think it was either yesterday or the day before. Um, this guy's not even paying attention. Like, I, he should have killed me. Look at this. And he, I don't even know what he's doing. Um, yeah, uh, I put up those two videos. One was, uh, I had color correction on, the other one I didn't. Tell me which one you like better. Because all my videos that I'm going to be making are uh, completely, completely user-based. I want you guys doing, as you can see, is this better? No, it's not. Um, also, if it's a bit better, yeah, speed perks up. For me, short and sweet's better than, like, long and boring. Except for when it comes to penises, but that's a completely different story. Uh, yeah, tell me if you guys like this sped up kind of version, just skipping the boring parts where I'm kind of just waiting for guys. Um, I'm always waiting for guys. And, uh, yeah, because, basically, I'll make the videos wherever you guys want. Like, I enjoy commentating, I enjoy playing this game. It's up, to, it's up to the community to tell me how to make the videos, so. Um, increase the size here. Um, I don't know what that guy was doing. You can't kill with a needler from that far away. And yeah, we really destroy these guys. So yeah, here I'm playing the objective. Can't really tell when I'm defending, because they don't really get to our, uh, I don't know what they're called, like, territory as much. Um, Scott wasn't moving this game, so... Shout out to Chunky Mangoes. Not his fault that he was negative five this game. It was just uh, he wasn't moving for like the first half. And I think we're getting yeah, this is the end. So this is the end, and then uh, I get this last last little kill, almost die for the killing frenzy right at the end. So that's pretty awesome. <coughs> and now we're Covenant. So uh, Covenant, yeah. I was, I get the, what's it called, needle rifle, or needle rifle, I don't know, something along those lines. And yeah, as you can see, from up there, you can probably shoot me, from, but from down here, I can't shoot them, because just the height advantage. So I decide just to run away, because there's no point in me wasting any of those bullets. And I might be doing a dual comm, or maybe even a trip comm with um, chunky mangoes and lots of b-balls on Saturday, I believe, or Sunday. Um, depending if they're free, uh, over top, probably a hot potato game. Um, so, yeah, you guys can look forward to that. And, um, yeah, I got a lucky kill right there. Just the explosion from the Neeler kills him. And, uh, right here I hide, and the reason why is because, yeah, the teammate's trying to spawn on you. So I thought, well, might as well get as many people as we can up here. And, uh, yeah, so I'm very, very soon I'm going to go for the objective. I'm just waiting to clear out all these guys so that they stop spawning. And then, uh... I almost get a triple here. If I wouldn't have switched to my plasma pistol, probably could have got a triple. But that's okay. 
Um, and also, those two shorts that I did put up yesterday, tell me if you liked them. Do you like those little, just little clips of me tearing it up? Or do you like, do you like these full-fledged commentaries? Or what's, what's your fancy? Uh, I've already, oh yeah, there's a, uh, there's a, uh, post-migration thing right there. That's why I kind of lagged out. And, um, yeah, I'm gonna get lots of your gaze for saying that's your, fa what's your fancy? Um, so yeah, we move on to their, uh, I don't know what, okay, first it's territories, and then, uh, I don't know what's after, I think it's territories again, yeah, it's territories again. Um, now this is kind of boring, but I sped it up, like, to 250 or something after, uh, cause it's just, I do rush very soon, but I, I didn't want to hurt myself falling down, so I was like, I, would, I basically want this entire thing forward and back, couldn't figure a way to get down without hurting myself. Finally, I found this little area, and plus I had a beam rifle, so that's pretty awesome. I think that's what it's called, beam rifle. If I'm not getting these terms incorrect, I'm sorry. I don't really pay attention to that much of the terms, but... And here, I take out the shields of two guys, and I don't even get a kill. Like, if I would have, if I would have, uh, played this a bit more smartly, or more smart, more smartly, uh, I could have, uh, could have got probably a double kill out of this, but I missed the bunt there, and then get shotgun from behind. So I lose some. That's okay. It's first death. It's not so bad. <coughs> um, now here's a little tip coming up. This is, I'm gonna move the mic. This is, uh, completely... I was just like, hey, maybe, and it kind of feels like you're flying, you don't take any damage, there's a little tip, you can just, and yeah, it's a pretty awesome feeling, because it feels like you're flying down to it, and, uh, hadn't played this map since the beta, so I thought maybe you could go through these, I was, really wanted to get to that scorpion, but, <laughs> I was like, whatever, fuck it, so I just went around, and, uh, what are we doing here, oh yeah, this guy's defending the flag, or the, well, the, yeah, it's a flag, basically. And, uh, take him out, and as you're about to see, oh yeah, this is nice. I think this, I thought this killed him, so I just reload. Doesn't, but look at this, I get a nice little headshot off him. That was, uh, that made me pretty, pretty awesome, that's pretty awesome. And, uh, I pick that up. And I don't know, you guys might know this, but I don't know if, um, if that's a one-hit kill, because that guy had a full shield, uh, and then I hit him with a thing. I mean, I dropped it, but it was still a one-hit kill, so I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. <coughs> and um, yeah, when it when it's the humans' side and they have the flag there, it's really hard to get it because um, all they do is switch to operator. Uh, I think that's what it's called, uh, where you have the shotgun, and it's it's a really tight area, and you can just just use shotguns to defend it. So. And now, uh, here, I don't, yeah, I didn't, sorry, I didn't fast forward here, and it's just a death, so I should have, sorry about that. And I should have stuck, but there's three guys in there, actually, I think there's two, one was a hologram. I don't know how I didn't get a kill out of this, but, you lose some, and you win some. And they reset the core. So, I think I speed it up here. Maybe not. Oh, no, that's, look at the spawn, I spawned right inside their base, so that was pretty awesome. And I take that guy out, pick up his shotgun. Grab the core again. So yeah, like I said, I, I played the objective much more in this game compared to last game where I was just kind of def I was still playing the objective, but it was a different type of objective. I was defending the uh, flag runner. And uh, this one, yeah, I see the ghost get taken down by a scorpion, and there's three of us running out of the door, and I was like, that guy's definitely going to get like an overkill or something. I didn't want that to happen. So I uh, just kept it in this room, hope we could win the fight. Unfortunately, I betray my guy, and uh, I also get sorted or shotgun or something along those lines. And uh, we should have won that gun battle, but that was my fault, so. Yeah, here I fast forward again, because it takes me like an hour to find that stupid thing. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, see, if you fall straight down, you take damage. I think you even take more if you're not lunging. And uh, yeah, it's a lot easier if you just jump onto that thing. And now Scott has it here, and he doesn't know like what to do. He doesn't know where to bring it. He's like trying to jetpack, but it's okay. Scott, uh, I don't even think... I don't know, Scott played a bit of Halo 3, but he's pretty new to Halo, so it's all good. Um, if any of you are wondering, I did switch my uh, Ten seconds game, uh, what's it called, controller setup for ha uh, Halo Reach to uh, Recon, which is basically Halo 3. Uh, I just like it more. I'm more used to it. been playing like that for, for years, so I didn't want to really switch it. And then, 
yeah, get sudden death there, which is pretty awesome. We would have lost if it wasn't for sudden death if we score. And that's a nice little win. So, um, yeah, if you guys liked it, please uh, like the video, subscribe, comment, do whatever you want. Uh, constructive criticism is always appreciated. And, um, yeah, I guess I'll uh, see you guys later. So, uh, take it easy and hope you guys have a good day.